blow for Prince Harry as Princess Anne to replace Duke in key Royal Marines role. Princess Anne is tipped to replace Prince Harry in a senior military role. The Queen's daughter will make military history by becoming the first woman to head the Royal Marines. Nephew Harry was stripped of the prestigious post after he married Meghan, Duchess of Sussex, and moved to the United States. The Princess Royal now holds the honorary title of Admiral in the Royal Navy. It is understood that her new job will be announced in August after official endorsement by the monarch. The royal family has undergone a number of changes over the last few years with Prince Harry and his uncle Prince Andrew seeing all their honorary military titles removed. Prince Charles has also assumed a leading role as the Queen, who celebrated her 96th birthday on Thursday, cuts back on public appearances. A number of new military appointments are due to be announced by Buckingham Palace including Princess Anne heading the Marines and potentially at least two new army roles. Regiments including the Marines, Grenadier Guards, Irish Rangers and Yorkshire Regiment have been left without an honorary head after Harry and Andrew were removed from their roles. Anne, 70, is known for undertaking a number of public engagements. She already heads ten regiments, including Colonel-in-Chief of the King's Royal Hussars, the Royal Scots, the Gurkhas and the Royal Army Veterinary Corps. Princess Anne is also married to Naval Officer, Vice Admiral Sir Tim Lawrence. As Captain General of the Royal Marines, Anne will be expected to visit new recruits in training, attend events and join commandos in the field. It is understood that Prince William was in the running for the role. But Royal Aides limited his workload in light of the Queen handing over duties to Prince Charles. A senior Royal Marine source told the Daily Star that the Corps would be delighted if the Princess Royal becomes the next Captain General.